So you just purchase your OLED TV and your screen look like this or like this or like this or like this Don't worry, don't return your TV yet Lately, I've seen a lot of people over-exaggerating the badness or the failure of OLED panels. This is caused by a lot of people, a lot of YouTubers, myself included, put a test pattern to check whether you have a defective panel or otherwise. However, just by having the tool to do the test does not mean you know exactly how to interpret the test. If during testing your TV looks like this, or like this, or like this, yeah, by any means, return your TV. Because there's no amount of breaking in will get rid of those imperfections. However, if your screen looks like this, when you're doing the test or like this or like this don't return them wait until about 100 hours 200 hours before you do the testing again and you make the decision at that time because all OLED panels will require some breaking in this resulting with a lot of people replacing or exchanging their OLED three, four, five times when they just arrive to their house. Please don't do that. If you find this video to be useful, click like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Leave your comment and click the notification button so the next time I upload a new video, you'll be notified. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye.